Thank you, Mr Nolan, for that information. That's been really helpful. I actually now know a lot about the health of your ears. Um, I just want to remind you that cotton wool buds aren't the best thing as, uh, for your ears. And remember the old adage, don't put anything smaller than your elbow in your ears in the future. Okay. Okay. Yeah. So, Mr Nolan's been um, removing wax from his ears uh, using cotton wool buds. And some of the wax is adhered to the canal of his, um, of his ear now. So what we're going to have to do is actually gently remove that wax. Right, Mr Nolan, what I actually want to do is that you have this level of wax in your ear at the moment, and we want to make your ear canal nice and clean like that. Okay. Now, um, I'm going to check both of your ears, but we're going to work on your left ear to start off with, and then we'll move on to the right when we've cleared your, your ear. Okay. okay? Thanks. So, First of all, I'd like to have a look in your ears again and just remind myself of the level of wax there is in there. Okay. Yes, that's very good. Okay. What I'd like to do now and what I recommend to all my patients is to use the squirt of ear roll on a regular basis to in there, allow the wax to actually move out of the ear quite naturally. So what is this? And ear roll is a, a mixture of saline and olive oil. Very, very pure and very good for moving the, the wax out of your ear. Okay. I'm going to give you one squirt of this and then we'll get this to soften the um, wax as we move it out of your so ear. So there's no dropper? There is no dropper, it's a metered spray. So oh, no. um, I've I'm seen going that to. Before. No, they're very, they're very new but very, very good because it gives you a measured dose then every okay. time. Thanks. And I can buy that from a scent? Uh, you can buy that from a scent. Um, it's uh, readily available across the counter. So if you'd like to look straight ahead for me, please, I'll just charge this and put some in your ear. Just one spray is all we will need. Pop your head on one side, I'll just work that in and that will start to soften your ear. Very nice. Okay, mm -hmm. I just have a look again. Thank you very much. Continually checking the ear every, <coughs> at all times whilst we're going through this process. Next thing is that I'm going to remove the wax with this small instrument that has got a little hook on the end mm -hmm. and that's very gentle, won't hurt you and that is what I'm going to use to just loosen it from the canal wall. Right. Okay. I need to put my headlamp on so I can see. Okay, like a miner. Yes. Very much so. Just like to look forward for me. Thank you very much indeed. Thank you. Okay. And I'll just gently now remove the wax from your ear. If you feel the need to, to cough, please just do so. Um, or swallow <laughs> if it tickles at all. Okay. Are you okay? You're comfortable? Yeah, I'm fine. I'm just... Do that again. Yeah. Hope that's comfortable for you. Yeah, fine. The wax is moving very, 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 very easily now. I'm just going to put this small. Um, little uh, cup into your ear because it's going to help me now remove the wax. So just gently into your ear. Gives me a good vision of, your, of the wax in your ear. It's going to take my little forceps and just bring the wax out. Feeling comfortable yep. still? Thanks. Just like no to have another check. It's just a little bit more wax that I'd like to remove. You still feeling comfortable? Yes, I'm feeling good. I'm 
just one more check. What I'd like to do now mm. is actually, um, I'd like to just rinse your ear, and we call it irrigation, and what we're going to do is just put some warm water into your ear, and the little bits of debris that have been left, we can then clear very comfortably. Right. You are, are you comfortable with that? Yes, I'm sure. Really good. Yeah. What I'd like you to do is hold that, and just pop it underneath your ear, just gently there, and look forward for me. That's fine. I'm going to just make sure the water is warm by running some into this tub first. And a little in your ear. One, two. Is that comfortable for you? You don't feel it in your throat? No. No? no. no. Okay. And a short burst of five. Five. That's lovely. Thank you very much. Thank you. I'll take that away. Okay. Just dry your your ear Thanks. and just have a look again. That's lovely. Under certain circumstances we may have to do that again and I might have to do it more than once in your other ear. Right. But that one's nice and clear. What I'd like to do now is dry your ear for you. Mm -hmm. Make sure that after we've had water in your ear, that your ear is nice and dry. There we are. Just another check in your ear. We continually check the ear at, at every point of the procedure. And finally, Mr. Nolan, I'm going to put one more squirt of ear oil in your ear, which will help to keep it nice and moist. Um, the olive oil acts as a, a, an antibacterial um, agent so that anything that's been in your ear uh, will not cause any problems for you. Thanks. Just pop your head on one side for mm -hmm. me. Thank you very much and pop your head back up and we'll start on the other ear now. Thank, Thank you. you. Thanks.